I'm not having a good day. <laughs> like, real, it, it's like real, it's a bad day. It's a bad day. I also am filming today. And typically, if I'm having a bad day and I wasn't planning on filming, I certainly wouldn't sit down to film. Like, that's just not natural to me. But uh, I had to film today. And all I can think about is why I'm having such a bad day. <laughs> and I have to do my job. I just thought I would like, talk through that real quick, just in case that struggle has ever been real for you. I'm sure there's so many situations that you can think of that you were just having the worst day and you still had to do your job. And I have to do my job and I really don't want to. <laughs> Today is one of those days in business where I had to pay stupid tax. Stupid tax is when you have to pay a lot of money for a mistake you made. Is it the end of the world? No. Am I gonna make that money back? A million times fold. Am I upset about it? I'm so upset about it. Like, I, it could have easily, easily been avoided. And so I'm mad at myself for that. And I also sit here and I'm like, why am I so mad about that? Like, there's a, way worse things happening in the world. This has to do with money, what is wrong with you. It's just such a tangible thing that's like, getting taken away from me. And so it's just very easy when you feel something being taken away from you, right? But there have been way worse things taken away from me, people taken away from me. And I'm mad. I am really mad that I almost said the F word and I never do that on camera. I'm very, very good at not doing that. I almost just said it really just now. So I have to show up, I have to do my job. I just am having a very bad day. I'm paying stupid tax and I'm just not happy about it. I was in tears, full makeup, no hair done, which is why we went flat today, honey, because I ain't have it. I still have to do my job. And so, you know, I talked to my husband about it and we got good, We, you know, we got level. Like the only thing you can do is just completely be there for each other. And I'm so grateful that I at least have that. Because even though we're both very frustrated, we're, it's just like, it is, it is a trip on like, the five mile marker of this marathon. So it's like, we're gonna be fine. It's not a big deal. But I let my feelings get the best of me. And then the next thought I had was, maybe I should sit down immediately and unload my emotions on camera since I am filming today. But I opted out of that because I needed to prove to myself that I could still do my job first. And so I sat down not to film this video, but I just finished filming the video I needed to get done today. And I'm actually really pleased with myself that I was able to pull through because when I sat down and I looked at my outline and I was thinking of the topic and I was thinking of you and I was thinking, I think they're gonna like this. This is gonna be a good video. I think this is gonna be useful and I have a lot of feelings about it and I have a lot of emotion about it. I, I, I think that my ability to do that has come from two things. And one is getting perspective as quickly as possible when something bad is happening. And talking to the right people about it and just trying to figure out, you know, where does actually everything stand? Don't think about it as worse than it is. Think about it as what it is right now. And then also be able to sit here as if I were going to a coffee appointment with somebody. I wouldn't unload all that crap onto that person that I'm having a coffee appointment with. I would focus on why we sat down together in the first place. And so I'm pleased with myself that I could come through on that second one, but I don't think that that could have happened without the first part. And I'm very fortunate that I get to have the first part. You know, some people are probably like not able to say, I need a minute when they, ha when they are asked to do their job. Like I can ask for that minute. And I asked it of myself and I literally only have a few minutes left now because I'm filming this one too and I have to move on to my next appointment and life goes on and things go on. And this blip on the radar needs to not hold me back and I, I just wanted to sit down and say that out loud because I'm wondering if you've got a blip on the radar and it feels like your radar just keeps blipping, like mine's feeling like it's just blipping and blipping. I'm like, stop with the blips. I like, I like it. I like it even. I like it maybe going up a little. And it's okay if it comes down. I don't like the blips. Okay. I got some blips lately. If you're feeling the blips, I'm feeling the blips. I'm sorry for what you're going through. And I hope that hopefully I am that person for you right now. If you didn't have that person for you right now that like can just say there's always up from here. If you're paying stupid tax or if you made a mistake or if you're kicking yourself because you haven't started something yet and today is not your day, turn it around. Don't hope for tomorrow. Do something so that tomorrow is better. That's what I'm gonna do because <laughs> 
Woo, this cannot happen again. This cannot happen again. I'm not okay with it. But I've it. learned. And that is why we pay stupid tax. So that is actually literally all I have to say. And uh, I hope it was helpful. And it's a little bit of therapy for me as well. So thank you for your time and attention. That's all for today. Thank you so much for tuning in. I appreciate it. As always, remember, subscribe for good vibes, kiss the ones you love, and go after the life you want. We gotta keep going. But first, I think I need a real drink. Okay? Cheers.